I went to the doctor just for a regular checkup, and she said, I want you to go to the, to the hospital and make sure you do it as of today. In the hospital, they told me that I have to consider dialysis and the kidney transplant. But as soon as I started dialysis, I started to look for a donor. Although they put me on a waiting list, but they told me the waiting list will take five to seven years. In the four months, higher, the angel of ours who helps everyone, she gave me a call and she said, Mariana, I have a donor for you. I donated a kidney in September 2005 after seeing an ad in a paper uh, placed by um, someone in need of a kidney. And I didn't know anything about kidney donation at the time. And I decided that I wanted to start, I wanted to start a project to help people need a kidney. So three months after I donated a kidney, that's when there was a Jewish, the marketplace, Jewish Marketplace Expo in the Javis Center, Convention Center. I decided to have a booth there. So I wasn't doing much ad before then, but I was accumulating a list of people who needed a kidney. My best friend from childhood is a recipient of a kidney. I was actually going to donate money uh, to a charity on, in her honor. And when I went on the listserv, um, I saw I was looking for a particular charity and I saw uh, Chaya's notice. It said, please, if somebody, you know, please help me save a life. Desperate need for a kidney donor with type A blood. So how could I just ignore that? How do you just, you know, scroll down and ignore that? So I just wrote back saying, well, I'm a type A blood. That was all I knew. So that's how I got to Mariana, is through the person who does a kidney match. Mariana. My angel. No, I'm not an angel. My angel. No. I feel for anybody who contacts me, whether race, religion, it doesn't matter. I am so happy to help somebody who's not Jewish just as much as helping someone who is Jewish. I have had, I have had make kidney matches, recipients were not Jewish. And there's no greater gift than the gift of life. The feeling of knowing you've given someone back their life, they don't have to be, if they're on diocese, they don't have to be on diocese anymore. They can be with their family again, they can go on trips with them. They're not tied up to a machine. A lot of people on diocese three days a week, four hours at a time. And, and you're, you're, you know, you're giving them life. Um, that's my reward. I don't get, a, I don't get paid a penny. I don't want to get a paid. This is my reward. My reward when I see, when I'm giving somebody back their life and they're be able to live because of, of a match that I made. This, that's the greatest reward in the world. I don't need anything.